Steve White with you on the Rural Radio Network on our road show with a stop at the West Central Extension Research Center in North Platte. And we're visiting with Dr. Rick Funston. He does a lot of work in the area of reproductive beef cattle. And you've got a symposium coming up that will be going on right here in North Platte. And national level folks are going to be coming and talking. Is that right? That is correct. We have uh, speakers from uh, really all over the United States. And um, I haven't looked today, but the attendance is probably going to be around 200 people. And we have people from most states, uh, at least the major beef production states. And national type experts. You're going to learn a lot of, at this. Exactly. They'll be uh, mostly from land grant universities. Uh, focusing on reproductive uh, management, both from the female side, and then we have some really new work, not here, but uh, mostly down in the south, southern part of the United States on bull development. And that reproductive side of things, that is so important. I mean, that's such a critical part of, of the business, isn't it? Yeah, it's the most important trade in beef production. I mean, we have to have a live calf, and then we manage them uh, otherwise, both uh, genetically and nutritionally throughout their lifetime. But first, we have to uh, have a conception and a live calf born. And you do a lot of work both here at West Central as well as at Goodmanson on that, along those lines. Yes, correct. And mostly on the female side, well, exclusively, I guess, really on the female side. We have been doing some work with some cooperators with, uh, on uh, increasing pregnancy rates through um, uh artificial insemination and some different management practices there too. And even tracking things like nutrition and kind of following the life of that animal and how all those various factors will then influence things. Exactly. We, we are one of the few institutions that still um, promotes and practices uh, total systems research where we look at things that happen even before conception and how that influences uh, that animal clear to slaughter or the fertility of the females. Some of the fetal programming work, uh, we have probably the largest body of production related work on fetal programming, looking at management of the cow before that calf is even born. And if you got, uh, if people are going to this, they're going to want to maybe come even a day early because they're going to be able to tour the, the newest, most modern beef plant in the country. Exactly. We have a pre symposium event that is uh, going to have a a roundtable of genetic discussion on on uh, making bulls to improve fertility in the cow herd with several uh, seed stock producers, and that's going to be out at TD Angus at Trey Wassenberger's, and then we are going to have another er, event uh, after that where we have a tour of sustainable beef. Which if people haven't been to, I, you and I have been there, we've seen it, and it's impressive, isn't it? Yes, absolutely. And people wanting to learn more, they should go to beefrepro.org and they can get all signed up, right? Yes, and then look under symposium or forward slash ARSBC, Applied Reproductive Strategies in Beef Cattle is what that stands for. September 17th and 18th going on in North Platte. Well, Dr. Rick Funston, thanks for being with us. Yes, thank you. On our Rural Radio Network Roadshow.